Hey guys, welcome back to World Mechanics. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be super helpful video to any of you guys having a Volkswagen Tiguan MK1. This is the first generation from year 2007 all the way to year 2017. If you guys have one of those and if you want to see how to recharge, refill your air conditioner, your AC system, we will explain that step by step how to safely do that. But before we do that, guys, let me tell you a little bit about us. Every single car we get here at the garage, guys, we try to make at least two to three hundred free repair videos we take them completely apart we show you guys how to fix pretty much anything engines bodywork transmissions why we do all that because our mission in the shop is to save you as much money as we can we guys have more than 12,000 free repair videos on our channels that can save you thousands of dollars in future repairs and if you need to buy any parts too so the good price quick shipping we'll share guys the link in the description of the video below where you can get them at a good price quick shipping that way we don't waste uh, you don't waste your money and time first you need to pop the hood open we're going to support it now and here we will explain guys what you need to do do you see that label right here it tells you guys how much refrigerant the system takes this is if it's completely empty if you're unsure how much you have guys we'll always recommend to get it you can get it to a uh, um, AC shop for a very small fee okay they will actually vacuum the system remove all the old freon oil and you can start fresh this is the oil oil that it takes back okay that's the oil ours okay uh, is already okay it just uh, uh, it's a factory AC so we need to just add a little bit because it started getting a little bit warm uh, this is a nine year old vehicle this is the R134 refrigerant right here we'll put the link in the description of the video below where you can get one form at a good price quick shipping as well you need to locate the low pressure AC port right here go ahead open that cap okay and that will be super tight okay right there perfect now what do we need to do guys we're going to connect it so we're connecting this one the pressure should be in red because we do have some pressure but the system is off we will go inside okay once we go inside we're going to go ahead, turn the air conditioner on. You need to press your button, start the engine and turn the air conditioner and the fan on. Let me show you for a second, okay? So if we come here, okay, you gotta make sure AC is on, fan is on as well. We're going to come outside now. And once we come outside here, okay, the fan will turn on. Be careful, don't hold your hands there. Okay, the refrigerant will start dropping pressure. Uh, and we're going to go ahead we're going to go ahead and start adding it okay so don't go upside down like that because that will go too fast and it can damage the system we're going to keep going okay just like this one right here now and make sure you don't overfill it guys okay don't go past the uh, past the green okay so in a little bit okay we're going to do that empty uh, about half of the can because we need to add just a little bit to ours if you start from empty you need to add 660 grams which guys okay these two of these cans will be 280 so just barely less than two cans okay if you start all the way empty so we can see guys okay we're in the green upper green this is because the outside temperature is really hot if it's colder, the, probably you'll be in the middle of the green, but if it's really hot outside, okay, if, when it's full, it will be getting close to the yellow line, but not all the way. Uh, now, never disconnect the hose, okay, uh, without actually, guys, turning the car off, because the belt is there, you don't want to get caught in it. So we'll go ahead, turn the car off. Always make sure that you turn the car off, guys. And you can safely disconnect it, okay? You don't want to be close to the uh, belt here and stuff when disconnecting because it catches your hands, you can lose your fingers. So you want to avoid that. And we're going to go ahead and place the cap so it stays clean and nice for next time. Uh, now, let's see, guys. We replace the battery on the gun right here because earlier I tried and it didn't work so we're going to go ahead start the car give it a little bit of time to cool and we will see what temperature we'll get now so guys we just got the gun and watch this thing out 2.5 celsius 2 it's going to get to the negative numbers guys now that's unbelievable negative one it still keeps dropping that's super ice cold negative two now negative three let's see if we can hit negative three okay and close to negative four 
Yep, my hand is freezing. Now, this one, okay, if we go to Fahrenheit 24.8 Celsius, negative 4, amazingly cold air conditioner, guys. Hopefully, that will be helpful to any of you needing help with that. Thank you for watching and see you guys next time.